Hello everybody, what is up? My name is King Spinach, and welcome to the very first uh, episode of live dealing with Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare. Now, those of you guys who might be new to my channel, I'm just going to get set up here. We're going to head into... Uh... Oh, I haven't played this game in a long time, and I kind of... Let's just do some gardens and graveyards. So, uh, I haven't played this game in a couple weeks. I'm just going to start off by uh, saying that much. And um, it's... it's uh... Live is a series that I used to do a long, long time ago. <laughs> like when I first started. Um, I used to just play multiplayer games, uh, live commentaries and stuff, and you guys got to see raw, uncut footage, uh, which is basically what most of my Let's Plays are, but those are focused on campaign missions and stuff. There's not that much multiplayer in them. Um, oh, people are talking. I'm going to mute everybody as soon as we get in here because there's quite a few young children who like to get on the mic here. Either that or, you know, something else. And I think we're just going to stick with the regular pea shooters so I can get back into the swing of things here. Um, ooh, and we still have time to set... Well, we don't have that much time to set up. Now everything's all good. Um, so, yeah. Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare. We're doing some live. Um, now, how I'm going to break up these videos is it's not going to be... It's not going to be 15-minute videos. It's going to be one singular game. Uh, of Gardens and Graveyards, and maybe multiple games of Team Vanquish, just because those tend to last the slightest bit longer. Alright, come on. Yeah! Got him. Alright. And, uh, yeah, that's all I would do with live. I would just kind of sit down, play some multiplayer games, and talk over them. Give you guys, like, uh, a play-by-play -play of what was happening in my head, talk about other things, talk about things that I liked about the game, talk, talk about things that I didn't like about the game. And, I, I don't know, it was, it was really nice, and I really liked it, and, um, I decided, I was looking back at all the things, <laughs> this guy's dancing, I was looking at all the things that I do on my channel, and there's a distinct, like, lack of multiplayer footage, so, I figured, like, why not bring live back, it was a series that I had a lot of fun doing when I still, uh, did it regularly, and, you know, it gives me the chance to kind of sit down and talk more casually about something rather than focusing on the campaign, which is really nice. Yeah, I thought I would get the double there. Awesome. And that guy's uh, chili bean bomb had nothing on my regular bean bomb. Or that, that guy's uh, sombrero. I don't know what this dude's doing. He's AFK. Ooh. Oh, I got... Did I get ZPG'd? Wow, that's a good ZPG shot. So, yeah, that's basically my plan for this. Um, mostly, uh, just... Oh, no. Ah, I feel bad whenever I do that by accident. Um, that's basically my plan for this. Just play some games with you guys, uh, show you some of my thoughts on Garden Warfare, and if you guys really like the multiplayer, like the raw multiplayer footage... Um, I was even debating, because um, those of you guys who watch my Forza series know that I have a, like, a secondary account uh, that I can use to record uh, for like other games or things, or sometimes I use it to do research for like campaign missions and such, uh, especially if I need help with something. I'll try it out off camera, and um, then once I figure it out, I'll be able to come back to you guys with uh, all of my newfound knowledge. And... I have that secondary account, I haven't started even playing PvZ on that account, and I was even debating just going with that, and, oh, come on, come on, yes, yes, I was even, I didn't even think that that would work, I thought that guy would kill us, oh, no, 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 I, yeah, I was debating, um, starting with that account and trying to, um, just play this game from the beginning with you guys so we can go through the unlocking process. I have unlocked most of the things by now. In fact, I'm actually, as you can see, rank 80 up at the top. I left it up there for like a split second, so I don't know if you guys uh, caught that. But I am rank 80, so I've got a lot uh, of progress in on this game. Um, I've done a lot, and... Um, Yes, got him. Wow, we had a five Vanquish streak. That's pretty good, actually. That's pretty solid. Anything over three is considered to be a good life for me. That's what I consider to be a successful life. I've got all of my characters leveled up to level 10. I've unlocked all the characters. Um, I've done a lot with this game. Uh, <laughs> I've played a lot of this game. 
and um, I'm still not bored of it, which is definitely saying something about it. I love it. I love playing this game. Granted, I haven't played in a while. Um, I've been mostly doing Watch Dogs recently, but oh, this game is just so classic. Oh, I thought I pressed Y there, but okay. Oh, he's coming in for the Ultra Tackle. Yep. I think I might shoot at that coffin. Oh, look at him. He's trying to jump. Alright, yeah, he's down. Ooh. So, yeah, even by now, I don't really focus on um, challenges that much anymore. Yep, I knew he was going to do that. Ah, dang. And I've really completed a majority uh, of the game, so... I think one of the... And one of the biggest parts of this game, especially for me, was uh, unlocking all the sticker packs and trying to see what you could get inside and everything. And um, that's a huge, that's a huge, like, thing in this game. That's a huge part of it, and it's one of my favorite bits. And if I really wanted to share that with you guys, then I would start over. So, uh, if this does really well, then I'll consider doing that. But for now, um, we're just going to play a few games, make a few episodes of live. Uh, this is mostly going to last throughout the summer. Maybe, uh, maybe when um, school restarts, I don't even want to think of it. I, I hate those things. I just want to get rid of them all. Maybe when uh, school starts back up again, we will uh, continue this. I'm not 100% sure. I'd like to. I'd really like to. But, and I don't know. You never know, right? You never know what's going to happen. <laughs> oh, it feels so good to be playing this game again. I can't even. And we're holding them really well. We're doing really good. Uh, if this game actually ends here, then I might even um, not... Uh, then I might put another game in just because uh, we held them so well that they didn't even get to the first capture. So, that would be... That's a very rare occurrence. Ooh, I should have left. Good long bomb on his part. I haven't really used the long bomb much. Uh, I'm not, not 100%, you know, like, fit with that yet. I don't really know how it works too well. I haven't tried a lot of the alternate abilities, actually. Um, I think I've tried all of the pea shooters, and I like them for the m most part, for the majority. Ah, oh, I wanted to get that engineer kill. I think I need them for a challenge. Oh! Should have seen that coming. Should have seen that coming. But wow, this was a pretty... I can't believe we won. Okay, maybe I shouldn't speak too soon, but I'm pretty sure we've got this uh, in the bag. Nice! Wow. That doesn't happen very often. <laughs> It, that does not happen very often. Look at that. 5,000. That's actually not that much. Wow. That's not... Yeah, that's not that much. But that's pretty good. Hey, we didn't do that bad on the leaderboard. It's been a while. See, I've been stocking up on coins. And while I haven't unlocked everything, I've unlocked the majority of uh, things. I've got all the characters and stuff, so that's... Uh, you know what? Let's take a look at the sticker book right now. I want to look at my sticker book before... We hop into another game here. And these videos are going to be maybe 20, 25 minutes long. Nothing um, too insane. But um, it's a break from the regular PPZ stuff that you guys see on my channel, which is just guides. Uh, so it's definitely something different, and it's definitely something that I want to do. So, well, you know, I'm, I'm very excited. I'm very excited. I'm thrilled. All right, let's uh, open up my sticker book here. So, oh yeah, I've stocked up on a lot of, uh, a lot of these, uh, consumables, the potted plants. Um, so there you guys can see some of my stats, uh, with the pea shooter. I've got all the alternate abilities. I think I've only got a few weapon upgrades for things that I, oh, I have all the pea shooter weapon upgrades? Wow, I didn't even know that. Alright, that's, that's an update from the last time. Uh, see, I've got, I've got some stuff missing, but the majority of it is filled in. Well, not here. Maybe I could use more there. So, there's still, don't get me wrong, there's still lots and lots of stuff to unlock. I'm missing a weapon upgrade, a few for the sunflower, and a lot of things, but there's, like, there's a lot of stuff. So, you know what? Let's, uh, let's buy some stuff with some sticker packs. 
Now you notice it won't give me any, after you get all the characters, I don't think it gives you any more spectacular character packs, so you can't buy those. Uh, let's get some, ah, do we want Zomboss down stuff? Let's just, let's get some Incredit Plant packs. I want some plant customization options, that's what I'm looking at. Ooh, I like that mysterious hat. Oh, hey! That's useful, that's also useful. That's awesome. Nah, I don't really, I don't know. I don't use these much. <laughs> uh, yep. That's pretty funny, I like that. That could go well on the future cactus. Ooh, another weapon upgrade. I like that hat. I'm not, I don't know how I feel about that one, but I like this one. Oh, nope, I almost bought that. <laughs> uh, let's get another Incredible Plant one, and then I think we'll get a Zomboss Down DLC one. Oh man, I'm getting all sorts of weapon upgrades. Ice Cactus, Mysterious Reloading Technique, Artificial Reload Upgrade. Extra frosty spikes. Oh, I like those. I've seen those a lot on people. I haven't... Uh, oh, this is nice. I like the raccoon super cap. Alright, that was pretty good. Those are both pretty good um, draws, actually, for the sticker pack. You can kind of hear when it opens the pack, like the crowd or whatever. Whatever you want to call it. Yeah, see, this one wasn't as good because it was just uh, weapon skins and the like. Like, these aren't... That's, that's neat, but that's not super cool. That's okay. I don't know if I would use that, mainly. I I'm definitely not going to use that. I don't really like that that much. This, maybe. Ooh, I like gestures. <laughs> that's a pretty cool uh, mustache, actually. That's really useful. Gotta love the skip challenge stars. And that's that's pretty good for the archaeologist. That's a really good theme type thing. Um, let me take a look at my characters here so far that we've unlocked. Got that. Oh, I, I made this my breakfast pee. And it's still got a little bit of work to do, as if on tattoos. I tried to go with, like, a theme for each character, and I was considering making, like, a video about it, but, you know, I decided, um, it might be a little bit confusing. Some- and now I've got some new hats. This mysterious hat is kind of nice. Eggplant one? Uh, I'm not feeling. Um, cheap toke. I put on Egghead, because it's the fire pee and it's like sunny side up eggs or whatever. And that's where these eye eggs come in. That's also for the salt and pepper, for more egg thing. And the, the leopard tattoo kind of looked, or the dirt spots tattoo rather, kind of looked like um, eggs or gave lock off like an eggy type thing. But uh, I, was, I was trying to look for a tattoo that would really work with sunny side up or whatever. You know, that's kind of like the theme I, I had here. It's definitely not flowers or anything, or tiles. Maybe tiles, actually, could work. Hmm. Not any of these mustaches. Not the mom tattoo. Something that kind of felt like it fit in with the theme. And that's what I kind of did for a lot of the characters. I have that for a majority of my characters, actually. Uh, I think I might stick with the... You know what? I might go no uh, tattoo. I might go no tattoo until I get a good one. All right, but that's like that's just a peak. That's not the only one that I have. I have a lot more. Let's do a team vanquish game. Um, I think if we get a chance, we might want to play on the zombies team. Um, but yeah, this is how I do most of my research. I just kind of for the guides at least. I just kind of play a lot and I uh, try and look at the damage numbers, compare and contrast with not only the sticker book but my own observations. Because it's really useful having the damage numbers show up in this game instead of, um, like, say something like Call of Duty where it's just three shots and, oh, that guy's dead. There's no, um, floating damage numbers. You guys know what I mean. You guys know what I mean. <laughs> uh, that's really useful, actually, for making guides and figuring out which kind of, um, characters and which weapons you like the best. Uh, but yeah, we got a lot of weapon upgrades, um in those packs. That's a really good pack, and sometimes, uh, I think I started talking about this, you can hear the crowd, if they scream like, ooh, then you're more likely to get more super rares and rare, uh, stickers. So, I didn't notice that until, like, a couple weeks ago, actually. Okay, kids are speaking. We're probably gonna mute them. Oh, awesome. Um, you know what? Let's, let's crack out the all-star here. Let's crack out the basic all-star. Um, and don't worry, I'm not only gonna be playing as, um, the basic characters. Uh, it's just I haven't played in a while, and uh, I just kind of want to refresh myself. Uh, later on today, I'm actually going to be doing some uh, recording for clips for the um, Sky Trooper guide, so that's uh, it's next on my agenda. But for now, let's stick with the 
false start. Ah, oh, I should have uh, imp punted or something there. That guy got me. I'm not a big fan of the ice pee. I'll say that much. I don't like it that much. I don't usually do very well with it. I don't. I don't know if it's a him or a her. That's why I keep calling it. Good. Wow, who's getting me? They have a setup there. Goodness. I'm ready. A lot of uh, tall nuts and such. Let's crack out a different one. Uh, ooh, I like the baseball star. He's pretty... He's interesting. I like how fast he shoots. But uh, also the baseball cannon overheats pretty quickly. So it's something to watch out for. that dude. There's a cactus coming right over there, so let's imp punt. Take him out. Wait for the sunflower. I see the sun- oh, I did not see that potato mine, actually. I saw the sunflower, and I saw the chomper, and I was prepared for the chomper. I was gonna sprint tackle my way away from him. Uh, but I was waiting for the sunflower to revive that guy, and then I could get an extra vanquish. Oh, no. Just do that and get rid of him. Uh, yeah, overheating is a problem with this baseball star. Wow, I'm getting owned. Normally, I do quite well with the all-star. It's a really tanky class, which is kind of it's what I like to play. No, no, no. I'm gonna I'm gonna leave that guy. I don't like to do that either. I hate when people do that to me. But he was gonna die anyway. So, and a thing to keep in mind that a lot of people actually tend to forget is um. I was getting shot from that side there, so I decided to uh, put up the <coughs> the blockers, the dummies. Uh, a thing that a lot of people forget when playing this game, and I think it's mostly uh, newer players as well. They don't, I don't think they're aware of this, but you can shoot when you revive, and you should really take advantage of that. It's an extremely useful uh, thing. So, all right, did we win that? I wasn't paying attention. We probably lost. Yeah, yeah, we lost. Those plants had a uh, pretty good system that they had. They were, they were pretty tight and focused. So, um, But yeah, uh, I think that's going to cut it for this video. We were all over the place today. We did a lot of different things, but uh, I hope you enjoyed, nevertheless. Um, got an inside look at all the, like, how I think about the game and whatnot. Well, it was quick. It was still an inside look. Uh, let me know if you guys are interested in me doing, like, a starting over type of series where I... Uh, try to we'll have like an overarching goal like a final goal that we're gonna try to attain um, With that other account like say our goal is to unlock all the characters or our goal is to uh, like I don't know be able to get like over 10,000 coins a match with every single character or something like that uh, just a unique little like goal that we could get uh let me know if you want to do something like that or if you just want to see me play through on a uh, separate account just so we can open stuff and like revel in that together because that's a huge part of the game and that's definitely one of my favorite aspects of it and i'd love to share that with you guys that would be a pretty interesting experience i'll think it over as well and um yeah i'll see you all in the next video of mine that you watch i hope you enjoyed uh this episode of live let me know if you want to um see more uh, live commentary uh whether it be in that new series or just like this with my uh already experienced people uh and um i'll see you all later but until then i'm out peace